This Shabbat, we complete the reading of the Book of Numbers. In the second of the two parshiot that conclude Sefer Bamidbar, the Book of Numbers, we have the description of the Arei Hamiklat, the cities of refuge. Now, these cities were established in the Promised Land as a, a, a place of safety for those who may have inadvertently committed the crime of homicide. But the concept of Arei Hamiklat, a place to go, to be safe, to have refuge, has particular significance for us right now. It seems like there is no place we can go where we can have refuge, where there's safety, where there's respite from the many things going on in the world today. into the fabric of creation, we do indeed have an ir miklat. We do have a city of refuge, a place to go. That place is the 25 hours of Shabbat, an opportunity to disconnect from the difficulties and the challenges of our day-to-day -day lives. As we approach this Shabbat, I urge you to take advantage of this wonderful opportunity for physical and spiritual and emotional regeneration and respite from the many pressures that we're facing. We don't know exactly how things are going to go in the coming weeks and months. But then again, if you stop to think about it, we never really know. Shabbat is particularly important in these difficult times, but it's always important because we always know it will be there waiting for us at the end of every week. I wish you all Shabbat Shalom Umivarach, a blessed and a peaceful Shabbat.